Chester's got finding words for everyone, both for his opponent and former team. <laughs> Bro, <laughs> relax. The <laughs> three sets for tonight. If players are willing to play another set, that'll be probably five to six sets for tonight. Yes, we're back in cheese Dojang ex action, except I'm not playing. It's Dojang exhibition action. So cheese Dojang action with an asterisk, I guess. <laughs> Welcome everyone who's joined us as well. Don't forget to slap a like on the stream and hit that share button. Cheese. <laughs> Jared's got the next making, so streaming now. And there you go, one mad access to seal the deal for Cheese tier. We both have a Fujin, Julia. <laughs> That's 13. It is 13. Here you go. Juker looking for an opening. No mad access this time. Was it worth to wait to have some cheese in? And definitely is. This is going to go straight to the wall. One magic four. Alright, so I'm so the combo I was doing is correct. There you go. Free follow-up. Non-stop is the cheese. The cheese. <laughs> it's like I'm referring to myself. <laughs> and share the cheese ladder around indeed, as there are no stars. That's the high most highly encouraged thing to do. And one parry. Juker not wanting to let this be a no round brown. But Cheese Tier is not going to wait for the Ching Wing Chun Master. One lashing arrow followed up and running two. One, two slices of red cheese for Cheese Tier. So is Cheese. Oh, they did swap sides. Hold on. So we're going to duo De Serio on Claudia's home court. Yeah, I don't think we've seen a Tekken 7 only tournament. By Tekken 7 only tournament, I mean Tekken 7 characters only. So all the Tekken 7 originals. I think okay, if I'm gonna run a tournament, that's the tournament I'm gonna run. I I'm kind of late. I'm due I'm due for running a tournament already. So expect that probably anytime soon. Not unless I get my job. <laughs> of course one magic for to seal the deal. Oh then there's another tournament tournament in two months. Beautiful. Iron crown the 13th. The 13th of the iron crown. Beautiful. And there you go. You know what else is an iron crown? It has an iron fist. Is you is Leroy back 1 plus 2 and Juker maximizing it all. One wall splat furthering. There you go. Balcony break. No more gimmicks for this stage. And that's... Oh, there's still a tail spinning. Guaranteed follow-up in the down 2-4 for Juker. 6-4-6 six, six to 7-6-1. Six, Ooh, big counter hit. Free follow-up. Oh! Yeah, DF1 does catch there, but I believe that that's if you're a bigger character. And I don't think Julia is that, that big. In terms of size. For, you know, that combo connecting in terms of hitboxes. Oh, wasn't that unsafe? However, no fear. Good wall position here for Juker. We're going to get the war drum is cheesed here. No duck on FF14. And great punish here. Cheese tier. Very aware. Where's the wait? I don't think he's even waiting anymore. <laughs> there you go. One big launch to get a full advantage here. Blue sparks, the blue cheese. So this is some STR cheese right now. We even got the Tom and Jerry PFP with cheese. Was this really Cheese Tier's original IGN? Do let me know, Arte. <laughs> if this is truly his IGN. <laughs> or is this new? Is this a new IGN? Mad Axes, here you go. One standing four. Huge life lead there for Juker at that point. Tournament with item moves. Okay, you know what? That's that's pretty good. Auto win round one if the item hits. Yeah, we need more tournaments that are just fun. <laughs> Most especially since it is the off season. Alright, those are those are good ideas. Second seven original tournament, item move tournament. So this is already a meta, right? What item what item should you pick? And then what character you should pick? Because certain characters have their own unique items, right? 2-2, two, two, big plus frames. And there you go, Juker tying it all a piece, one all. You got nothing, we got some fighting heroes on the other side earlier. Okay, but the score, since it's one all, I don't have to change that. Alright, alright, alright. Yeah, you can you can also parry the fireball. I mean, wait, is it fully confirmed that Leroy can parry Armor King's Rage Drive? Because he, I saw that clip on Twitter and I was like, whoa, that's, that's insane. There you go. Keeping the 1-1 one, one string safe instead of going for 1-1-1, one, 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 GG Clef Cannon. Going for 1-1-2. One, one, one and there you go, a basic throw. Was that a basic throw or was that a command throw? I forget. 
because I haven't been utilizing Julia's throws. I did try. I did. I did. We are not compatible, and I don't have the execution for it. Oh, but full string. That's going to be a ton of damage. Major major positional advantage for Cheese here. Oh, optimal combos. Here we go. Not going for the one. No need for that blue cheese because we get a second wall bounce. Going up to zero again. There is no waiting here for the cheese tier. Also, Leroy can just parry everything now. So I guess that does include Armor King's Armor King's Rage Drive, which is kind of unfortunate for Armor King. Do you think 2D characters would be an ideal tournament character? Again, assuming your execution's on point and you can rely on your execution. You'll be fine. Because again, Geese. Geese and Akuma are very strong characters ever since they dropped into the game. Of course, Akuma took a little bit of time for, of discovering and finding another player to show us that example. Mainly from, again, Pakistan. Eliza is really long. A Tekken 3 only tournament would be dope. Oh no, they already did that. The guys from BAT already did that. They did BATANG 90s. That's, that's mainly Tekken 3. Or Tekken 3 below, if I remember. Yes, there was, there was indeed. Legacy characters. Ban the trash talkers. What happens if the trash talkers play? <laughs> Again, you let the game speak for itself. Put your cheese. Put your cheese where your mouth is, right? Sub teeth. Don't kick us, please. <laughs> because you do have to break throws. We'll see how that goes again. Still very, very early in the set, although adjustments should be able to start kicking in right now. Although, what I'm guessing from these fighting words is these players do have history and they know how to play against each other already. They know how what 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 each other's cheese is. There you go, catching cheese tier with a slower move. And catching it with the faster move in back one plus two. Ooh, great conversion here from Juker. Getting the wall, big advantage. Going for the full thing. And Cheese Tier out of the wall already. However, Juker wants Cheese Tier at the wall. But Cheese Tier says no, there is no waiting. Of course, if that was still season two, Julia, that running 2 1 would have definitely wall splatted. However, in season four, they had to nerf that. It was too strong, really. Yes, you can visit their page. Many people do stream. No low parry on that on that low. Again, you cannot punish that low. You can only low parry it. Oh, cheese tear was like, <laughs> I can read your mind. I see the future. One. Oh, and that does connect. DF four two back forward one, and that that's three one. So if you want to message me, you can message me through this Facebook page. Not unless it really has to be done personally. <laughs> <laughs> but if it's mainly for just Tekken stuff, it can go through this page. Mm -hmm. Beautiful conversion here from Cheese Tier. Good break here from Juker. F22 looking for something. No punish for Cheese Tier. Oh, beautiful parry on point. Ooh, did that just miss? It did. It did. Oh my goodness. The backlash, but DF21. Five slices of cheese for Juker. Round two. Fight. Of course, we got we got we got chat wanting some Gigas cheese tears. Like, please, thank cheese tier. Please play Gigas. Please play Gigas. <laughs> we shall see if cheese tier if if cheese tier loses. Will he swap to Gigas? We don't know. Is Gigas a true cheese tier? Big counter hit. What is the wall carry? Oh, that could have done it. Maybe FF1 to hop kick into the, the hit. I don't know. Down three. Beautiful stuff here from... Oh, and Juker running it back. That's two five slices of yellow cheese for Juker. 648 to 762. There is no waiting <laughs> for the cheese. DF3 1 plus 2. Looking for an opening. Are both players and catching cheese tier again with the back 1 plus 2. It's been highly serviceable for Juker. There you go, throw galore for cheese tier right now. Wall. Oh, no punish on FF2. That is unsafe on block, ladies and gentlemen. Should be around negative 12. Your 11 frame punish would do, of course. F22, there you go, finally catching cheese tier with all the movement. Looking for, looking for something, it's Juker. Was that a setup? The second hit of the Hell Sweep hidden. 
Oh wow, what a what a fortunate situation for Cheese Deer. Again, that is not plus, and there you go. Great job from Juker. Putting it three to two. We got fighting work. He's woken up and chosen violence. Because we got we got a costume swamp for Cheese Tier. Of course, Sugar. Sugar was there earlier. Will we see Sugar from Juker? If it if Juker, of course, if Sugar is applicable, of course. Again, beautiful punish there from Juker. Well awake, well aware. Here you go. Nice! Not letting the FF14 go this time. This may not reach the wall, but it should bring closer and closer. Here you go, good wall position. Well, not wall position, but good enough positioning. Of course, the wall is behind Juker, and of course, Cheese Tier does recognize that. Well, just, just believe in your cheese. Believe in your cheese, and you'll get two slices of red cheese. Going for the DF21. Bow and arrow. FF2, again, that's catching tech pe people who tech. No, no low parry on that again. That is unsafe. Apparently not negative 13. So 1, 2, 2 should be enough for Leroy. Going for the whole thing. DF3, 1 plus 2. I have not seen 2 back as a punish. Oh, that is not that unsafe. Of course, I'm not sure if Leroy can even catch while standing 4. Because even Huaran can't catch while standing 4. Oh no, that's going to be get a guaranteed. Oh, the second hit. Nature was on cheese tier side there. What you think? Oh, I have some, as I was messaging someone else on Steam, that was big seven slices of cheese. Perfect for the cheese tier. Oh, that does reach, huh? Fantastic punish for Julia there. Oh, against Leroy, lashing arrow non-stop. Of course, we're requesting the Gigas. You need, we need Juker to get a game off cheese tier. Or, of course, again, again, the rules are highly encouraged. Ooh, big throw. So you can't just swap upon winning. Perfect. Was that two perfects in a row? I believe that was two perfects in a row. Classic stage, and I got there in time. Another character, another costume swap. Aside from character swap. All right, all right, all right. I don't want to taunt, but I, 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 but I got fighting words for everyone though. <laughs> Ego one G clef cannon, G cheese tier new. It was counter hit. Ego one down to three. The panic option, not wanting to let Juker get any advantage whatsoever. Is this dead? Quite close to, but the kip up enough. Ooh, big launch. The soccer kick. Will this reach the wall? It doesn't need to. That follow-up is enough and five slices of cheese again for Juker. Gab! Love that kind of cheese. Here you go, ready, fight again. Oh, back four. It's like these players are reading each other's minds. They see the future into each other's books. Maybe they've bought each other's published books. Oh, wow. That, again, that's unfortunate for Brian. That kind of should have hit grounded. That's why you need to use down four. But sometimes even down four doesn't connect, right? The woes of being a Brian main. Oh, no punish on the wall standing one. Oh, no punish again on the G clef. However, an FF4 is enough. Three, two, one. Oh, looking for Oki. Is Juker in the DF2-1. So we got five slices of cheese and two slices of cheese. Juker adding more to his cheese platter. His cheese plate, rather, in the cheese platter, in the cheese buffet. Lashing arrow, non-stop. Here you go, but F4-1 denying whatever cheese tier wanted there. Man, I keep repeating the word cheese over and over again because his IGN is cheese here. <laughs> One, two, three. Bow and arrow. All right. They're in the corner. Sidewall does save lives. Juker trying to change this positioning into his favor. Unsafe. Oh, counter hit. No confirm though. It sometimes does take you by surprise. Down three. Oh, down three. There you go. Denying the the rage drive of Juker. Oh, Mad Axis, the classic. Instead of wall standing one, the unsafe one, we switched swapping it to wall standing one two. The safer version, again that's the launch and counter hit. Bone arrow, yep. Pecking, and there you go. Cheese tier. On the cusp of becoming a Dojang exhibition winner. What is the plan for the cheese? Who is not me, by the way. <laughs> One, two, three. A little short there, but no punish for cheese tier. Very confident that 
not needing punishment to get these games. But Juker staying consistent with these punishments. F4-1, great with punishment. Into the wall. Taunt, looking for that extra damage. Kip up. Getting out of that situation quite cleanly. And putting Juker in that scenario now. Oh, wow. He did grab, he did, he did, he did, and there you go. That's going to be 4-3 for Juker. Staying alive. Needs two more games, right? Is this CSGO? I have not played a lot. I haven't played CSGO in quite a while. Then again, I'm not really a full fan of FPS. Oh, and unfortunate, that could have connected. We gotta play some Left 4 Dead. How about after the stream? Because <laughs> it's gonna take some time for what he call this, this stream to download and then for me to edit it to match mods. Give or take it, it takes like an hour or two. Boom! One, two, three. Both players. Oh, quite even and lively, but no more. Juker having those hatchet kicks. Oh! <laughs> Round ender denying the rage art of cheese tier. You can say Juker, it's Juker tier. How about that? Way higher than Cheese tier, maybe. We shall see. The Eternal Ruler versus the Fujin. This could be a DM. They're only one rank away. DF23 catching Cheese tier with the second hit of the strings. The same way Cheese has gone. CT has gone. Second strings to hit Juker. I saw Brian Brains indeed. We saw, we got the peer into the mind of the Taunt Jet Upper. The man, the master, the cyborg. We saw the inner mechanisms of how it works. It was spacing it out, but the lashing arrow coming out. But one counter hit. Was that a lashing arrow? It, it might have been. There you go. No drop this time. 100% hit rate. There you go. Half life. 40 seconds left on this clock. Both players kind of in a hurry a little bit. Plus frames. We'll see if Cheese did. Oh! Could have gotten the confirm of that, but great break on the Mad Axes. Huge plus frames after plus frame, going for the mid safe. Oh, right there on the dot versus the bow and arrow. Orbital heal. Juker channeling the inner Brian fury within him. Great punishment. Here you go. Juker. Firmly in control right now, in the pace. Being able to adjust fully to what CT's got. Oh, Tonjet upper. Five, seven slices. And that's for all peace fighting work. <laughs> There you go, SS Georgie, seeing the Gigas. Oh, got the Gigas and it was definitely worth the wait. Of course, overthrow. That went in there. End mill. I remember the name of that move now. <laughs> beautiful, beautiful punish. However, non-stop cheese from CT. I'm gonna call you CT now. Cheese tier is a mouthful and I keep repeating the word cheese over and over again. Oh, here we go. Got a guess in the 50-50. I mean, how I usually do it is I look if there's a, like, a, a flash of light or not. So if there's a flash of light, that's the unblockable. If there's none, I need to mid. Here we go. Throws non-stop. Learning from Julia. Doesn't have to be a command throw or whatnot. Here you go. CT, two rounds ahead. Again, swapping characters is big. Because again, your opponent's been adjusting to one character this entire time. And you're surprising them with this pick. We'll see if it works. Is Juker adjusted? Oh, Taunt Jet Upper! Here we go! Wall Splat. 1-2. Looking for another. Oh, there you go. The, taunt, the, 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 the throw was a little bit too short. Oh, that is not negative 15. That is negative 14. That means you can get an FCDF2 as Brian. That's gonna be a huge punish. Here you go again. No, no unblockable. Good punish. On the down two. Again, that is that is unfortunate. That is unfortunate for Brian. But Orbital Heal. This is where dreams are made. In Soob, the Horang home, court, Ho, Horang home Court. So again, whoever likes Horang more gets a buff. <laughs> and Overthrow. Negative 10. There you go. Northern Cross. Ending it in style for two slices of red cheese. Final, final round, ladies and gentlemen. Fight. Put your cheese where your mouth is. F21. Free damage. Oh, looking for a throw. That was a generic throw. Keeping, keeping it locked in with the checks. The mid check upon high check. Plus one. Oh, that is not that open upon armor. 
Snake Edge? Oh no, it could might have paid the price for that one. 40 seconds. Huge life lead for Cheese Tier and the one two, the second hit, just like Julius. That is enough for CT to take the set. Good games to both players. Good games.